On Wednesday, Elon Musk's company SpaceX said that it is curbing use of its Starlink satellite communication service by the Ukrainian military. Apparently, Ukraine's use of Starlink to guide drone attacks against Russian forces is a no-go. The question is, why now? SpaceX sent thousands of Starlink terminals to Ukraine last year to provide internet communication. Now the company is saying that Starlink was, quote, never meant to be weaponized and it's taken steps to limit its use with drones. Starlink relies on a network of satellites in low orbit around the Earth to provide wireless communication. Well, the Ukrainian government in Kyiv has condemned the decision by SpaceX, accusing the company of ignoring Ukraine's right to self-defense. For more now, I'm joined from Kharkiv in Ukraine by Dimko Zlutenko. He's founder of the Ukrainian military charity Zigas Paul, which supplies drones and other high-tech equipment to the Ukrainian military. Dimko, it's good to have you with us tonight. Um, I want to pull up something that your organization posted on Twitter earlier today. These are photos showing Starlink terminals and charging stations delivered to Ukrainian soldiers. And you tweeted that the equipment was um, well received by the boys. Let me ask you, um, will these soldiers, will they be able to use this equipment the way they want to now that SpaceX has announced plans to limit and maybe even block access? All right, thrilled to be here, and I'm actually on the mission to deliver some of these Starlinks to the front lines in Donetsk region now, and I'm just having an overnight stop here in Kharkiv. So tomorrow I'll be downrange and I'll be setting up those Starlinks, and uh, they will be able to work correctly as intended, as supposed to be, as it was before. Uh, given that uh, the statement by the SpaceX uh, president um, it was only referring to putting Starlinks into uh, unmanned aerial vehicles uh, to mount Starlink into them to control uh, those drones uh, from uh, Starlink, having Starlink as a communication for the control plane. Mm -hmm. But it has nothing to do with all of the other use cases, such as uh, communication, such as uh, uh, streaming the data from the drone, like. Uh, live streams, etc. So they have no problem with that, I suppose. Well, I mean, what have you heard? Have you heard any reaction from soldiers? Uh, because it is true what you're saying. They'll still be able to use Starlink for communications. But Starlink has said explicitly this, the technology cannot be used to launch any attacks against another power, against Russia. So that means they can't use Starlink to coordinate their drones for any type of offensive act against Russia. Mm -hmm. So I think uh, a few important things to highlight here is we just got to start with uh, Ukraine as defending itself. And according to any international law, Ukraine is free to strike any target in Ukraine for the purposes of defending our country. So Ukraine only uses Starlink in defense purposes. Uh, whatever that action would be, it would be in defense purposes. And who is a real aggressor here is only Russia, who is, uh, if Russia withdraw their troops, the war would be over. Uh, but uh, what they really said, um, the president of uh, SpaceX, is they are okay with uh, having Ukrainian military use the uh, Starlink as great a piece of technology for uh, communication and mm -hmm. uh, actually the communication is a massive has really enormous amount of use cases in Russo-Ukrainian war since most of the communication methods that you would normally use in the war are either destroyed or being jammed by Russian uh, radio electronic warfare or just being disabled by Russian electronic warfare. Yeah, Dipka, what do you make and, though? Uh, um, um, what do you make though of this decision um, from SpaceX regarding Starlink? I mean, it seems to have basically come out of uh, out of nowhere, and uh, the Ukrainian military they've been using uh, Starlink now, for, you know, in this war, you know, we're almost a year into this war, and now suddenly this this announcement. Mm, I wouldn't say it's a sudden announcement. So I think uh, Starlink, uh, they play Russian propaganda card on uh, the whole world. And uh, this is actually isn't, uh, isn't the first case uh, 
uh, I am tasked with uh, giving the interview on this mm -hmm. topic of commenting over some of the SpaceX uh, actions. Uh, it was uh, very huge in October, I think, when right. Elon Musk said he's uh, not into funding Starlink for Ukraine because this is so expensive, etc., mm -hmm. which was uh, not the case at the time. Um, and uh, I think this exact case is very related to what Russian head of Russian delegation to United Nations said on 31st of uh, January this year. And he, I think, like raged uh, on the uh, uh, whole world uh, saying it's very unfair uh, to uh, give Western satellite capabilities to Ukraine uh, to its defense. He says it's unfair that Ukraine is able to defend itself, but in his mind, it's absolutely fair to launch an offensive into Ukraine, kill our people, rape our so people, Dimko, destroy our cities, etc. <laughs> Dimko, let me ask you this. So do you trust Elon Musk? Do you trust uh, SpaceX? I mean, th this is this change it does not help the Ukrainian military. Absolutely. It wouldn't be of any help, but so far they are covering a very specific use case. And uh, as long as they are not tackling the uh, main communication cha channels uh, uh, from uh, Starlink, it's not that bad. But obviously, uh, the company itself, uh, they made a lot of public statements that are literally Russian propaganda. And uh, Elon Musk has a long history of uh, been pretty much affiliated with uh, exactly Russian propaganda. Yeah, that's so a very, I wouldn't it's... say that I trust him yeah. uh, or the company itself, but at the same time, the technology is crucial. Okay. Uh, but in our case, I think that uh, it would be painful, very painful to lose it, but yes. Ukrainians would figure everything out anyway. With or without Starlings, Ukraine is determined to win, and this is the only option.